Welcome back to Expresso here on SABC3. It is a fantastic Friday and it's about to get even better. It's time to take a look at your youth sport news and we've got everything from Sevens Rugby to soccer. Let's check it out. Tomorrow marks the beginning of spring and with that, a new set of youth sports to look forward to. From soccer to Sevens Rugby and even mountain biking. But first, your weekend preview of the sport happening in and around your area. East London is in for a treat on Saturday morning as the Atlantic Sevens tournament comes into town. This is the 10th stage of the overall series, with the ninth and previous round having been played in Belhar last weekend. As hosts, Sterling High School hopes to put on a good performance, win the battle and prove themselves to be the best in the province. They'll have some strong competition though for that crown, with a 15-a-side powerhouse Queens, Dale, Selborne College and Grey High School also in the fray. Our matches start at 8.30 in the morning and the cup final will be contested at 4.30 in the afternoon. So grab a picnic basket and the whole family and get down there and support the lads. Now, moving up north. King Edward High School take on Benoni High tonight in Johannesburg as the school soccer season continues. The hosts had a good start to their season, winning against Jeppy and Hilton College. They narrowly lost 3-2 to rivals Park Town Boys though in another tight encounter. Benoni High will be hoping to put a stick in the works of Kers' soccer as they themselves have a rather formidable side this year. We are sure this shall be an entertaining match. And finally, out in the Western Cape. It's the biggest high school soccer tournament with the most prize money in the history of South Africa. Yes, it's the K Motsepe Cup. This fantastic tournament has prize money of a whopping 1 million rand. However, what makes this tournament so great is that the money is used for development of the school. Now, the tournament also serves as a method of reviving the culture of high school soccer in South Africa, and it's been hugely successful. With 5,000 schools entering teams, we can only hope that the long-term result of this tournament is a World Cup trophy someday. This weekend is the Western Cape Regional Finals out in Beaufort West. Westridge Secondary School defeated Beaufort West Secondary School in the correlating fixture last year with a final score of 2-0. So the rugby season might be over, but there's many other sport events to enjoy. So get out there and support all of our young stars in the making.